payment terms the payment term says the transaction code anila obb8 right yeah obb8 payment terms yeah right for example if you look at the payment terms here mm -hmm. the payment term says you take 3 percentage cash discount when you pay within 14 days okay and then you take 2 percentage cash discount if you pay 50 days mm -hmm. and then if you pay within 45 days net it's net you don't take anything you don't there's no cash discount you pay the full Yes. But in a bigger companies, they don't care. They don't. They don't have to honor this, right? They said, you know what? I will still pay in forty-five days, but I want to take three percentage cash discount. Yeah. So you cannot go and demand them, right? As long as you get the money, business, you're good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that situation, you, so you can configure when in the FBCP, you mm -hmm. configure saying that take maximum cash discount. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think somewhere here. Yeah, right over there. Here, yeah. Yeah. if you say maximum cash discount, system will mm -hmm. take the maximum cash discount. However, it still pays on the last day, net due date. Mm -hmm. Got it. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, mm -hmm. this is one. Yeah. Got it. Mm -hmm. The next issue, then you know this, how do you set up number ranges so that you don't have to maintain them every fiscal year? True. How yeah. do you set up number ranges for so that it, it's not very specific to payment program, but it creates a lot of documents. So I, I just throw in here. Got it. So, because it typically in our organization, the number ranges, document number ranges are year specific, True. right? So yes. every year, that's one of the year and, year and close activities, right? I think yes. the transaction code is FBN1. Mm -hmm. yeah. Is that right, Anila? Mm -hmm. yeah. She's the transaction code queen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So every year you maintain the number ranges. This, this is per fiscal year. Right, so you don't want to do this every year, come and maintain this, rather you want to continue, use the same number range, right? Not say recycle, continue using. Recycle is a different word. When you want to yeah. continue using the same number range next year, then the following year, or the next year, the following year, then you use 999. Here you put 999, which means the number will be used all the, every all year. All the years, yeah. See here, 999. Every year. Yeah. So it be used for every year, you don't have to come and set this every year, okay? Got it. Now, what if you want to change the payment method to other than what is mentioned in the vendor master? What if you want to change the payment method to other than what is mentioned in the vendor master? So when you run the payment proposal, for example, okay, when you do the proposal here, system